The Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to Saint Mark, Mark chapter 2, verse 1 to 12. The Gospel narrates the healing of a paralytic by Jesus, illustrating not only the miraculous power of Christ, but also the profound spiritual implications. Let us reflect on how this reading highlights the call of a Christian. And when he returned to Capernaum, after some days, it was reported that he was at home, and many were gathered together, so that there was no more room, not even at the door. And he was preaching the word to them. And they came, bringing to him a paralytic carried by four men. And when they could not get near him because of the crowd, they removed the roof above him. And when they had made an opening, they laid down the bed on which the paralytic lay. And when Jesus saw their faith, he said to the paralytic, Son, your sins are forgiven. The call of a Christian involves persistent faith and a commitment to bringing others to Jesus. The four men carrying the paralytic demonstrate determination and creativity, going to great lengths to ensure their friend encounters Jesus. This reflects the Christian call to actively engage in the lives of others, being willing to go beyond conventional boundaries to help people experience the transformative power of Christ. Now some of the scribes were sitting there, questioning in their hearts, why does this man speak like that? He is blaspheming. Who can forgive sin but God alone? The call of a Christian may face opposition, just as the scribes doubted Jesus' authority to forgive sins. Christians may encounter opposition when sharing the message of salvation. The Christian call includes perseverance, and the courage to stand firm in the face of opposition, trusting in the authority and truth of Christ. And immediately Jesus, perceiving in his spirit that they thus questioned within themselves, said to them, Why do you question these things in your hearts? Which is easier? To say to the paralytic, your sins are forgiven, or to say, rise, take up your bed and walk, but that you may know that the Son of Man has authority on earth to forgive sins, he said to the paralytic, I say to you, rise, pick up your bed and go home. The call of a Christian involves the proclamation of God's authority and redemptive power. Jesus not only heals the paralytic, but uses the occasion to emphasize his authority to forgive sins. Christians are called to boldly proclaim the gospel testifying to the transformative power of Christ 
in both physical and spiritual restoration. The Christian call includes being messengers of God, redemptive love, and the authority of Christ over all aspects of life. The Lord calls us therefore as Christians to persist in faith, bring others to Jesus, be ready to face opposition with courage and perseverance, and boldly proclaim the authority and redemptive power of Christ.